Hey, we're back with Newsload and Michael at the Highland. We're outside now. We're at yeah. the marquee. We're at the main entrance. Yeah. It's a busy Warncliffe street. It is very busy out here, which is why we have uh, this very cool retro looking marquee. Of course, you can see how it, it, it does hang out right to the road. So uh, you can see it has had some uh, wear and tear. Built in the 30s uh, and kind of was a, a, was a theater's live place that people would come. Sure, and, sure. Um, and then it really picked up steam, I would say, in the sort of 60s um, as people started using the cinema for their entertainment to, as a cheap form of entertainment, right? So that's when it really started to get its mojo going. How, how people remember it is sort of definitely in the 60s when it, like I said, became like a much bigger deal to come to the movies and they would do all these special things and events and, you know, all these different live elements to the shows. And yeah. it, we'd like to support local businesses. So that's a throw out there to local businesses if you do want an add on screen. Yeah, and that's a great point. All of our trailers are, again, tailor made for the Highland, meaning that, yes, they are the trailers that you see online or at other theaters, but they will have our dates and our logos and stuff on them. So if it's a special event or a series or something, we'll create trailers sure, uh, sure. Our, ourselves. And um, sometimes we'll even have special pre shows for certain shows so especially in October with it being Halloween month um, for a lot of the shows there'll be like special stuff that you'll see in front of the movie that you won't see anywhere else um, that's very cool so, exclusives yeah, yeah so yeah a guy that's scooping your popcorns running upstairs to then like run the 35 mil film uh, yeah everybody yeah. pitches in it takes a village yeah, or like seven people in our case, so yeah. <laughs> seven people in the village. Yeah, that's right. Wow, what a load.